Hey guys, Ultra Maximus back with another Transformers review. This time we're going to take a look at Scalor, one of the Generation 1 Seacons uh, released by Big Bad Toy Store, an exclusive uh, reissue set. So here we have Scalor, who is a coelacanth, kind of. Uh, here he is in his robot mode, in his uh, beast mode, and his weapon mode on the side of the package. Now, uh, just like all the others, uh, Scalar has a little card, so we've got some artwork, we've got the nice little foil. Here's the back of the card. Um, if you want to pause and read his stats and bio, you can. And he is an amphibious assault trooper, is what good old Scalor is. So let's take a look at this little guy. Um, and he is small. He is one of the smallest, I think, of these robots. Just real stout. Uh, very very much like a minicon. Uh, kind of reminds me of Braun for some reason. He just looks burly. He looks like a running back. Um, nice big forearms, kind of Popeye style. Again, not much going on. It's the same G1 color scheme of blue, kind of pink and purple. Um, not much posability. His arms are going to go up and down, and that's really about it. He's got lots of kibble hanging off of his back. So, yeah. Really not much there in the robot mode. Let's look at his beast mode. Alright, so here we have Scalor in his beast mode, in his coelacanth mode. Kind of. Uh, and they're all kind of beast modes because they've got legs and arms, half of them. Um, it looks like he's got a nubbed off little tail. Poor guy. Um, but I tell you what, the, looking at the front, again, just like Tentacill, I do like the head sculpt. I, I like the kind of very fishy mouth. I love the pieces around the eye. Looks really nice. He's got these like little nostril things going on. He's got the Decepticon logo on his nose. And he has a mouthpiece there with these nice gnarly teeth. I mean, he really kind of looks like he could be uh, in the Sharkticon group. Um, he looks very similar to a Sharkticon. Um, he's got the little fins here. that would be nice if his mouth opened uh, a little bit. I mean, it wiggles just a little bit, but that's really about it. Um, he does have nice scales uh, on his back, so that's kind of a nice little detail. He's got these uh, little gills, if I can get out of the light there, on his side. And, of course, his fin up there at the top, and he's got a little fin back here, too. So, I mean, all in all, it's not a bad little beast mode for Generation 1. Uh, again, I think it'd be a lot cooler if uh, we had a Generations line of these guys. I think that would look kind of neat. So let's take a look at his weapon mode and see what we think of that. Alright, so here we have Scalor in his weapon mode. Again, nothing too terribly impressive. You basically straighten these guys out, and I guess that could go up and make it look a little cooler. Straighten these guys out and you put a gun barrel on the front of them, and that's really about it. Uh, so, yeah, it's just kind of there. Um, again, cool gimmick, great idea. It's just, I don't know if the G1 figures actually are able to pull it off. Uh, it'd be kind of cool if they actually used this in the uh, Master Force cartoon. Um, you know, that'd be kind of nice. You see the uh, a group of, you know, four of the Seacons running out on the attack and Snap Trap in the back using somebody as a long-range cannon. I think that'd be kind of cool. So there he is, Scalor, from the G1 reissue series, limited edition from Big Bad Toys. Thanks for watching, guys, and look for more videos in the future.